in this short video I'm going to show you and explain to you how to put together the consumables in a P70 machine torch. We'll look at the torch first. On the end of the torch there's a little pin there. Make sure that, that is in good condition. Make sure it's clean. There's an o-ring on there. Make sure the o-ring's in good condition. These are the five components that make up the front of the torch. These are the two parts that are classed as consumables. You've got an electrode and a nozzle. They're the bits that you change quite frequently. That part there is the actual body. That's a shield, copper shield. And that's a swirl ring. I'm going to show how you put this together. It only goes together one way. Or at least it only goes together properly one way. The first thing is you must make sure everything's clean. Especially this little bit of plastic. It's very important you don't go in the attic with dirty hands. Or at least oily hands. So the first thing we do. Screw the shield. Onto the main body. Then we'll get the swirl ring and the nozzle that plugs into there. It fits together nice. That simply drops into there. Then the electrode drops into there. It all fits together nice and neatly. If it doesn't look like that, you're doing something wrong. That simply screws onto the front of the torch. You just tighten it on like that. You don't need to put a spanner on or a set of mold grips. Just nip it on. And that's basically the torch assembled. I've got some consumables here that are worn out. There's a nozzle there, you can see it's quite badly burnt away. Hole's not round anymore. That's scrap, that's finished. An electrode there, you can see it's been really hot and the end's burnt off it. That's scrap as well. As a shroud here, these do give a lot of trouble, but this one. The hole's not round anymore. It's damaged inside, so that's that's basically done its bit. One little word about safety: you never go anywhere near the plasma torch when the machine's turned on. In fact, it wouldn't be a bad idea to unplug it from the wall. <laughs> 